everybody, welcome back to Grandma's Corner, where making videos is a blast. So guess what? Today we are going to conduct a little bit of an experiment. We are going to make something called oobleck. What is oobleck? Well, oobleck is a made up word and it's a gooey consistency, kind of like a slime, but it has very interesting properties. I already made up some, and we're gonna have some fun with it in a minute, but I'm gonna show you how to make it right now. All you need is some cornstarch, some dye, and some water. You need to put in a couple of drops of dye into one half cup of water. I'm gonna put in about five. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco. That's gonna be a great color. And I'm gonna mix that up. And the reason why I wanna put the dye in the water first is I wanna make sure that it gets evenly distributed throughout the water. Next, we are going to get ourselves one cup of cornstarch. Now you're asking yourself, what is cornstarch? Cornstarch is used in cooking to thicken things, like gravies at Thanksgiving time, when you have all those juices and fat that come off the turkey after you have this big turkey cooked up, and you go, well, what do you do with this stuff? Well, you add cornstarch and a little bit of water, and then you put it into the, to the liquid, and it creates a beautiful gravy. But today, nah, we're doing a science experiment. All right. Half a cup of water with dye, and then you're gonna start adding slowly the cornstarch. So I'm gonna shake in about, I don't know, maybe a third of that cup. Round and round we go. Oh, we're gonna have a pretty little rose color because white and red really makes pink. Now I'm gonna go ahead and shake in a little bit more. It dissolves pretty fast, so you don't have to worry about this being too time consuming. Okay, even though we've got some chunks in there, if you just keep getting the liquid onto those chunks, it's going to eventually dissolve. All right, now I'm gonna put the last of that cornstarch in there, and you can see that when we mix this up, some of it gets hard, some of it's loose. You think, what's happening here with this? This is the weirdest thing ever. And it's getting all mixed up now, and then it's almost ready to play with. So this oobleck, which came from a book written by Dr. Sue, and that book is called Bartholomew and the Oobleck. It's all about this stuff or oobleck that falls out of the sky and creates havoc in this town. Well, we're not gonna create havoc, but we are gonna have some fun. All right, so let's watch what we're gonna do with this. If I put a big blob of this in my hand, oh, gross, and I go ahead and I start to, oh, I don't know, let's see if we can make a ball. You're gonna watch what happens. The two properties of oobleck are liquid, as you saw in there, and solid. So as I'm mixing this around, I can actually make a ball, but you're not gonna believe what happens after I make the ball. Then it starts to go to a liquid form again. This is the craziest stuff ever. Look at this. Round and round we go. So you can gross out your friends or your brother or your sister. Just make sure that you find a place where you can play with this stuff that's not going to get on carpet or the floor somewhere because your mom and dad might not be very happy with you. Outside would be a great place for this to take place. All right, if you feel like this is a little too runny, you're welcome to add a little tiny bit more of the cornstarch, and that'll thicken it up a little bit. This is also very easy to clean up. Just run your hands under water, and you can clean up lickety split. You don't wanna put this down the sink, however, so if you're done playing with it, throw it away. But if you want to save it for another day to play, put it in a container 
that's airtight, and then you can play with it another day. All right, here we go, folks. This is oobleck. Try that word. O O B L E C K. Oobleck. All right. Have a great day. Thanks for joining me. I'll catch you next time.